Okay, so how to patch Apple HDA for ALC 255. So it's 10EC 0255. So now they have this CAX call ALC. And this ALC now is version 1.14 and this one is High Sierra 10.13 on Dale Broadwell 50, HD 5500 and I7 5500U so what you need to get this thing working perfectly is to install the Apple ALC this is the one so this one is version 1.14 and use the original HDA Apple HDA and also you need a CAX called Kodak Commander this one make sure for it to wake up and work you need one in here they have two two fifty five they use the profile called two eighty three I believe it's really hard to see from this but from here you can see it easier this is X code and the profile here they said 255 they use Realtek 283 ETC the default make sure these are correct perform reset yes check interval 3000 send delays 300 and perform reset on, on failure and external EAPD fail is our no and then when we go to the 283 ETC uh, we make sure the perform reset is yes and delay is 300 sleep note is no Okay, so each of the 255 and the 283 is different. You can hit this one if you don't do it correctly. When you wake up, you have no sound and no microphone. All right, so that's it. So that's correct, Commander. And we also need Lilu. Because 1.14 ALC, Apple ALC, is dependent with the Lilu. And make sure your USB host family that connects is patched with your USB to make sure they work okay so Lilu so the Lilu version 
is 1.1.7. So, now, they have HDMI and also the regular codec. The regular codec, you need to patch. Now, I forgot. There's three versions on the ALC, Apple ALC. One for Maroney, I think that's what how you put down his name. Uh, Apple ALC, let's go back here. And he uses I layout ID3. That one works. The one from Deep Pack doesn't work. So let's look at this. So the plug in is the same for everything. So let's look at the IO kit personality. Not this one. Better look at this one. Plug in. IO config. Oh no no no. You got to package content content and we go to the info list. Now we go in here we look. So what we should do is should go out in it F search for 255. You see right here it's version one. So the original one layout ID three this one works. Neroni Insanely deep pack is 13 and layout ID 17. These two don't work for high Sierra only. It did work for the Sierra, but not on high Sierra. So if you're using the Mac OS high Sierra, you have to use layout ID 3. So we have to patch the DSDT. Layout ID 3. Okay. And at the same time, for the HDMI to work, we're going to use when we patch, rename the HDAU. I name this one, uh, the layout ID I use on this one is 13 see you change this one to 13 then when you go to the config file you put 13 so where's the config file So don't mistake the audio, the layout ID you when you inject 13 here. This injection is actually for the HDMI. It's not really for the codec to work. The codec to work is the HDEF. Okay? H D E F. So this one is the one we do layout ID here. This one have to match with the one we chose for the Apple ALC. 
So now I use Apple ALC, I use Moroni layout ID3, and this is after wake already. My sound works. Okay. And the input microphone, I'm recording it right now, so you gotta work. So that's how you patch Apple ALC on Mac OS High Sierra. And this particular graphics is HD5500, which is Broadwell. All right, that's it.